Ruslan. Ruslan very good. Huh? Ruslan is a good friend. Yeah. We evoke. He's very happy with the Crimea platform. Exactly, yes. He would just do his best. First of all, we are people, and then we are leaders, ministers of our country. But first of all, we are people, and I appreciate such very, very high-level humanitarian bilateral relations between us. And I also wanted to thank you for coming to support this meeting, this conference, Bucha Summit. And of course, we want also to thank you for supporting uh, our candidate status. You did big work, especially you, Prime Minister. Thank you very much. And the third one, I wanted to thank you that you uh, supported our army to be strong on the battlefield. Because from one side, the diplom diplomacy is the weapon, but from another side, there is the priority, be strong, because Russia understands only such attitude. So thank you very much for all these uh, packages that you gave us, thanks to your government, and of course, thanks to people, because without supporting of your society, you couldn't help us as much as you did. Thank you, thank you very much. Great pleasure to be again in Kiev, first of all, and also compliments for the organization of this special event dedicated to Bucha and the crimes and the atrocities that were committed there a year ago. I really felt the wholehearted atmosphere of support of the people, of the soldiers, of policemen, of families, of NGOs that you today honored with your decorations as well as the support of um, the mayor. And I think this is a, a great reflection of the atmosphere that you are managing to keep highly motivated in these really difficult times for Ukraine. And this has been, in my view, one of the most important elements that Ukraine has, first of all, stayed so united and so committed to defend. And second, that you have managed to grasp the unprecedented international support for Ukraine. This is a novelty nobody has done, and I really have to say it's a lot of this is your personal work. I have the feeling you are not only genuinely promoting the narrative of the just war for freedom of Ukraine, but that you have so much energy that you do it sometimes more than once a day, and that is incredible. No one else has been capable of doing so. So a lot of this support goes to your personal involvement together with all your colleagues, but this has been uh, spectacular, honestly.